You know, one of the most difficult things to do when you have a small business is getting your name out there and getting people to see who you are and the services that you provide. And one of those ways is doing it online. In this video, I want to share with you guys some things that you can do to increase your online visibility of your small business using a couple of tactics and something you probably already have, your website, some SEO, and a tool that's out there that's going to give you information about some of the things that people are looking for in your local market. So let's get into it. Let me show you exactly what I'm talking about here. What up there guys, this is here once again with Get Busy LLC, helping home service business owners, contractors, small businesses understand this whole internet thing and getting their business out there in front of the people looking for the services they already provide in their local markets. In this video, I wanna talk about increasing your online visibility of the services that you provide in your market. So on this channel, I tend to run into a lot of home service business owners and contractors and those types of small businesses. And one of the most difficult things to do is getting your name out there and getting people to see what you do, the services that you provide in the local area that you provide those in. And one of those ways to do it, the most difficult things to do is do it online. I know there's a lot of people out there that post stuff on Facebook, they share their information with friends and family, Maybe they're doing some other stuff like flyers, mailers, radio ads, Google ads, and things like that. But there are some things that you can do on your own to help you increase your online visibility of your business using something you probably already have, which is your home service, small business, contractor website, and understanding simple principles of search engine optimization, SEO, which basically stands for optimizing certain pages on your website to get found for specific searches that people are making online. So what I'm going to do is, is share with you guys a great tool that's out there that costs about 70 bucks for the entire year that you can do to do a little bit of research and start to understand some of the things that people are actually typing into that Google search bar that could relate to the services and the business that you provide in that local market. And it's gonna give you incredible information and I'm gonna share with you guys what to do with the information that this tool gives you. So let me show you exactly what I'm talking about here. Okay, so the very first thing that you have to understand is that if you have a local business, if you're a home service business, uh, you have a contractor business, you have to understand that there's gonna be a monstrous amount of people that are gonna look for your service and they're going to look for it on Google. That's just how we're programmed, that's just how it is. And I don't think, Things will be changing anytime soon. So I would recommend to go out there and get something called Keywords Everywhere. You put it into your Chrome browser. It's a little tool you could get here. And the pricing here is for like a local business. It's not really much. Six bucks a month, but they just bill you annually. That's 72 bucks for the entire year. And this tool is amazing because it gives you great information great feedback on things that people are typing into Google specifically. So then what you have to do for your website and your business is to actually just build out pages for the service or the things that people are already typing into Google. See, people are typing certain things onto Google on a daily basis, on a monthly basis. And if you just built out a page to put in the pathway of those people looking for those searches, doing those searches is going to place your business right in front of them and showing them what you do. So let me show you some examples. So let's say that you are a home remodeling contractor out in Maryland, right? Let's say you do that, that's your business, that's what you do, you do kitchen remodels, bathroom remodels, entire home remodels, that sort of thing. So with this Keywords Everywhere tool, once you install it, you'll put it into your Chrome browser right here, there's a little button on here. Let me show you real quick here. You turn it off and turn it on. So I turn it on and I did some searches, just random things, right? in Maryland. So I typed in bathroom remodel, Silver Spring, Maryland. There's a small town in that in that state that I was just doing some research. The reason I came up with this, uh, I recently ran into a home remodeling contractor in that area and I was kind of explaining to him, these are the types of things that you need to do because there are people that are on Google, on either on their phone, on their tablet, on their computer, and they're going into Google and they're typing in specific keywords, right? Just like this. So this one, two, three, four, five words are being typed into this Google search bar. And you have to think about it. Who in the world is actually typing this and putting it into the search bar? 
somebody who wants a bathroom remodel, obviously, right? So here it is. And what this tool is going to tell you right here is it tells you that there's 70 searches a month being done for that specific keyword. So you, as the business owner, what you should do on your website is to build out a specific page for that specific search. So you'll be basically the answer to somebody's prayers. And I did some research to see if anybody's out there doing that. And this is exactly what I found. Somebody did exactly that. So I found this website, Jennifer Gilmore Kitchen and Bath. I've no, I'm not working with this business owner at all. I'm just doing some research. It's just, just to show you there's some people that know what to do out there online with this SEO stuff, with their websites and all this keyword search stuff. So I click on this right here. This immediately tells me it's a bathroom remodeling in Silver Spring, Maryland. This is exactly what I was looking for, right? As the customer. So I click on it and you're going to see this contractor or this business built out a specific page for bathroom remodeling Springfield, Maryland. These guys are geniuses. So what they did is they placed a specific page right in the pathway of somebody looking for a kitchen remodel. This, thus starting the process of potentially me, the customer, start to look into their website, looking and see their portfolio, some of the things that they do. But this was basically a page built out to get found for that specific search. Now I typed in kitchen remodel. Let's say me and the wife are talking about remodeling our kitchen and we lived in Silver Spring, Maryland. So this keywords everywhere tool is telling me Kitchen Remodel, Silver Spring, MD, these five words are being typed into Google 90 times. That's a lot of searches. When you break that down, like I said, these are just estimates. So it's about three people every single day are jumping on Google and typing this exact term. And you're going to see a bunch of pages built out. And then I look to see if that contractor or that business is doing that again. They are doing that exactly right. They're doing it again. Kitchen Remodel, Silver Spring, Maryland. See, now they build a specific page for that specific search so that this page will show up. And again, the customer runs into what they got. They'll start seeing their pictures and it starts to build that relationship with this business, with the customer looking for the service this business is providing. Now, I do the same thing with business owners that I help with their websites and their SEO and all of that stuff. That's all SEO is. Your It's called search engine optimization for a reason. You're optimizing pages and your website to get found for specific searches. So like this example here, Asphalt Paving Reno, these three words are typed into this Google search bar 70 times every single month. That's a great number. And when somebody types that in, this business owner's website is showing up right here. It's showing up right now, usually shows up underneath because of the, the saved search right now. But what did we do? We built out the homepage specific for that search, asphalt paving in Reno, asphalt paving in Reno, specifically designed to get found what people are typing into Google in the first place. So what you do then is you go in to do some further research and start to figure out other things related to that area. And that's what the cool thing about this Keywords Everywhere tool, it starts to tell you some of the things that people type in to give you more ideas on what to build specific pages and get your business out there, that specific page out in front of people looking for the services that you already provide. So it gives you a bunch of stuff and it does it for all types of industries. It doesn't matter if it's a paving, a remodeling, a concrete, whatever it might be. And you have to spend a little bit of time doing a little bit of research to find out things that you can potentially build out pages for. So Reno, Nevada is about, I don't know how far away is from Carson City, but Asphalt paving Carson City, 10 searches a month. That's good enough for me. Asphalt paving is not like carpet cleaning or junk removal where there's a vast volume of searches done every month, but there is search volume nonetheless. So asphalt paving Carson City, I saw that there was 10 searches a month. So I figured why not build out a page specific for that? And now you'll see this page is ranked number one here, asphalt paving company Carson City. And again, we build out a specific page for what somebody is already looking for. Here's another example, asphalt repair in Reno, 10 searches a month. Why not build a page for that as well? And you're going to see, not only is their page, their actual homepage showing up right here, that specific page is also showing up right here, high quality asphalt repairs in Reno. And then we build a page for that. And then of course there's other services involved with asphalt like seal coating. Even though it doesn't show, show a search volume, 
just common sense and just logically thinking, people will type that into Google seal coding services, seal coding blacktop, that sort of thing. So we just went ahead and decided to build a page for that as well. And you're going to see there's that page ranked right here, seal coding in Reno, Nevada, another page. This time it's built for seal coding services. So again, this places your, your business, your website, your presence, this places your services out in front of people already doing the search, already ready to buy, already ready to investigate, already ready to start doing some homework and reaching out to potential business owners. So there you have it. Those are some ways to increase the online visibility of a small business like a home service business or a contractor by using keywords everywhere tool and start doing some homework, a little bit of work to find out exactly what people are typing into Google that's related to the services that you provide. And then all you have to do is build out pages for those exact services that people are looking for anyways. And all it does is place you in the pathway of those people already looking for those services. And some of those could instantly become a phone call, an email form, or they start looking through your website a little bit more, start doing some research to want to learn a little bit more about you, and then reach out to you to help them with their problem or the service that they need. And that Keywords Everywhere tool, it, it brings you back so much information for like 60, 70 bucks, or whatever it costs for the whole year. It's amazing. So if you're like a junk removal business owner, you're going to see that people actually type in different types of things like hot tub removal, shed removal, hell, even stuff like couch removal. You'll see people actually type that into that search bar in a certain location. So then all you have to do is build out a specific page for that particular search and get your name out there. Same for a roofer. People type in roofing repairs. Sometimes they type in gutter installation, gutter repair, chimney repair, concrete services, the same thing. Concrete contractor, retaining wall repair, retaining wall installer, stamped concrete work, decorative concrete work. Different locations have different numbers of volumes of keywords for certain things based on the geographic location, obviously. And of course, this also brings you back information of actual location. So let's say you lived in a big, big area you're going to see that some people make little searches for some, some of the smaller cities in your area that maybe are 10, 15, 20 miles away. Then all you have to do is build out a specific page for that small area that some other contractor, home service, or local business hasn't even thought about doing. And that's how you properly use your website SEO and this Keywords Everywhere tool to start increasing the online presence of your business and get you more leads coming in your door. So that's all there is to it. It's not super complicated. Um, on this channel, I try to make things easy to understand. I know there's so much SEO information, so much digital marketing stuff out there, and it just it, it just makes people's brains scramble. So I try to simplify the entire process to make it just the average person, make it easy to understand. So if you guys are looking for some help, need some help with some of this website design, this SEO stuff, getting your business out there, you can check out my description below. I have links to some freebies that I have. Also the services I provide. Maybe you want to book a call with me. You can do it all on there. And I'm here to help your business get found online and get more exposure. And one of those ways you can do that is something called backlink. Another super complicated thing People like to talk about here on YouTube. I've noticed that too. And is it possible to actually even rank a website without backlinks? I created a video specifically for that where I talk about that right here. You can check that out right there. And that's all I got for you guys today. Until next time.